Good day, lords and ladies, and welcome back to Battle Brothers with me, Cornish Knight, and our Cornish company. Now, last time we left off, we had just taken a contract to take, well, to take a supply load of gear back up to Watel. So this is going to be a long, a long trek. Now, for any of those who, those of you who are wondering, I am playing it on the veteran difficulty setting with Iron Man turned on, so it's relatively realistic. To be honest, battles in the well, I should say battles, more like skirmishes. In the medieval period, people really didn't like to get into battles, not if they could help it. You've got to understand that, yes, and like historically speaking, if you're in a battle, it's sort of like. Oh, you can decisively defeat the opponent, but at the same time, he can decisively defeat you. So, it's not fantastic. Um, a lot of people prefer just not to fight them at all if they could. Oh, come on. Oh, I not want to go along this road. In... Oh god, that's bad. Do I dare cut through here? I might. It's off the beaten path, but it saves us on supplies. And this is where it all goes absolutely... <sighs> ...terribly, terribly wrong, because I can't see anything. And now my luck would probably walk right into a orcish ambush or something. Can we even get through here? I don't even know if we can get through here or not. What's that? God, please let it not be something horrible. I could so be it, do without it being something horrible. How long will supplies last? Three more days. Oh god, that's bad. Into the mountains. Although deep in the mountains you can see the peaks of... Oh god. Cordelia stretching further onwards yet eats pipe typing up between the valleys and other, hiking through the passages and sometimes finding passages of your own you have been hard on your men, slopes and wind, wind stones and sediment and unruly gravel ha have your men clambering on hands and knees, each slippery year, and yet around there you are mountain goats tipsing about one bounds impossibly up on a, a incline well, with mocking ease and other cathems the dry grass between confused bleats, bridges of stone Overhead with um, Jurassic geology, bear the winking heads of curious mountain lions. You get the feeling you've seen your who you've you get the feeling you get the feeling they've seen your kind before. And now they know not to attack, but they fall nonetheless. Maybe one will fall and break something, and the maims shall be left behind because they're carrying the wound in such a place is death for two. Taking stock of men, men, you find many are suffering injuries, sin splits, sore calves, throbbing knees, probably some broken bones but nothing fatal, only the strong and agile can safely navigate their way through the place such as this, and indeed they are typically the first to topple over every clam. Oh god, why did I come this way? This is a bad idea. And of course it's our archer. Memo to self, stay out of the mountains. And we managed to get through that. Problem is it was going to be like a massive trance around. I don't know. Uh, hopefully it was worth it. Come on. I want to get through this marsh. Oh, that's not good. Get to the road, man. Get to the road. Thank God, a trading caravan. I'm supposed to be mercenaries, and yet I'm absolutely terrified. Lang's holes. You've never seen more inviting, my friend. Ooh, our money situation is bad. Our food situation is bad. Everything is bad. I should never have gone south. Uh, 
Let's just camp for a little bit. Dawn's here. Need supplies. Get some berries. That's going to go off soon. Let's just get on our way and get paid for this. We'll stick to the road for this. Uh, oh, we've got enough supplies now, we should be okay, but even so, that was... How's the guy with the finger? Is it still broken? One to two days. I mean, they heal really quickly in this game, but I suppose they sort of have to. If they were like, if it was like realistic, oh, it's going to take you absolutely ages to heal anything. Company. These guys are suffering attacks quite badly by the look of it. Wonder what's causing it. Humans, maybe. Orcs. Don't know if goblins would do it. I doubt goblins will have the strength to do it. Let's just turn in this quest. Because, I mean, that's. Yeah, I think it's a bandit enclosure. Looks like it. I mean, I could try clearing it out. Let's just get in and get paid. Arthur the Elder welcomes you, and a few of his men hurry over to take the cargo. He claps you on the sword. I take it your journey went well. You spare him the details and inquire about the pay. Bah, sell sword through and through. Frederick, get this man what he deserves. One one of Alfred the Elder's bodyguards walks over and hands you a small chest of coin. Let's just camp for a little bit. My pace situation is still really bad. I need money badly. Is there any contracts? Yeah, I'm not taking that. I mean... What is this guy armed with at the moment? Short bow. It's not great, but I need to save money. It does a bit more damage. About it does about twenty percent more damage. That ignores the armor. I save what I have for now. I need money and I need easy jobs, really. Let's go up to Hell Hovel. Try Grimstad. God, things are not going well. Seriously, no contracts. Could really do us some work. Don't want to go too far north in case I start running into unpleasant things out in the wilderness. It's better left unmentioned. Oh, finally a contract. Tostan, the treasurer, stuff a sizable crate in your hands before he or you even say a word. Look, look at that. Cargo I need delivered and has already found someone to sip it off. What wonders? He drops the theatrix. I need you to take this to Kuvland, where a man by the name of Ulf of Kuvland is waiting for it. It may look small, but I'm willing to pay good count crowns to be sure it gets there safely and sound. You interested? Or a little too heavy for your arms? Let's talk money. Let's just see, where's Kufland? Carveland? Where's Carveland? I don't want to step, accept it and we end up going... Uh, Carveland isn't so bad. Relatively straight. Mm. 
I say straight walk, but it's a lot straighter than it was from all the way down there, and it's basic money. Why not? Could do with the coin. Let's go. My pockets are feeling light these days. No, take a shortcut. He says, last time that happened, we ended up... Uh, I can just hear my impl my fellow, like my, I see employees, but probably my subordinates grumbling at me in the background. It's like, oh, why are you marching us across tundra? It's, we're freezing in this, in all this gear. Blah, blah, blah. Typical mercenaries. I'll get on the road. We'll probably go a bit quicker. I mean, I could probably go across country. Maybe do that. Why not? Was there once part of a nearby settlement now burnt down and abandoned ruins? We'll go into the basically these lowlands. There shouldn't be anything here anyway, so we should be okay. How's our food situation looking? Six days. How's our pay looking? Thirteen days. Hmm. How's our crew? Well, they're all healed up, which is not bad. Let's get to the road. I just want some nice, basic jobs. Nothing too fancy. Why oh, do I get the feeling that's a bad thing we're coming across in the woods? Oh god. Nineteen. I can't take that, I'm gonna have to retreat. Oh, seriously? I lost Wiseman and I lost Lilycorn. <sighs> Did I manage to get any of my gear back? to get the crossbow back, but it doesn't matter because I've lost like lost some really good guys. <sighs> Seriously, what is my luck today? Shepherd. I'll take this guy. Uh, gods. How's he looking? I can give him a weapon. Well, 
look like you got your wish, Runkle. Is there anyone here with better range skill? I mean, he's got to develop faster, but at the moment, I need everyone who can actually wield a weapon as I can get. Uh, fine, I'll... God, everything is so messed up. All my guys are injured as well, so I can't afford to really... Absolute mess. It's like, oh, simple job, get through the woods. Just someone that I know. And we sell call this guy. Twisted Tales after another small YouTuber that I know. Uh, like, are we going to be able to get through here at all? Was this way completely like out? Oh, God's sake. We might just die straight here. Isn't that great? There's goblins and. Try and get some kind of sealed wall up. Because my guys are in no state to be fighting right now. nearest archer. God, so my guys are wounded and everything, so it's like none of them have any chance of hitting. Poison arrows. How are we out of ammunition?
Don't tell me. Oh, I didn't give him the bloody quiver. <sighs> Seven hells. Does he have a quiver? Yes. But of course, all my guys are injured, so I can't hit anybody. Just, which is just fantastic. God's sake. I might just lose right out here. Come on, guys. At least we have some fortune on our side, at least. was risky. Oh, gods! I have no way of getting any of the eyes. <sighs> Got no luck today. He's fleeing. going wrong. I just wanted to try and complete a contract, get a bit of money in. And now I'm even in a worse position than I was originally. I can't get through the forest to deliver the contract. Can't hunt down the last goblin. Uh, when did this all go terribly wrong? I haven't got enough stamina. Do we get anything at all of use? A little bit. forest, because they outpace me as well. Kid Vermin is no longer in a sound fighting shape, his wounds have gotten infected without immediate care, it may take some time for him to get back into shape. We need money. If I hadn't 
just taken that cursed job. See, now they're being done in by those blokes, but still too risky. I'm going to have to try going through the woods. Please let there not be anything. I need this pay. Oh god, I've got wounds all over the place. So going terribly. After some looking, the man asks, a man asks who you're looking for. When you say a loaf of equivalent, he points you out towards a nearby paddock where a man is strutting on a rather opulent looking horse. You walk o on over and the man rears his steed and asks if, it, if that's the cargo to Toston, the treasurer sends you nod. Leave it where you f leave it at your feet, I'll come and get it. You don't, you don't. Instead, you ask about your pay. The man sighs and whistles to a bodyguard who hurries over. See to it that this self sword gets the pay he deserves. Finally, you put the crate on the ground and make to it leave. Such bad neck. Let's talk about pay. Please let us be some cheap food. A little bit, not loads. I need to sell some money. I need to sell stuff, literally. That's a nice sword. Because right now I am broke. Because I need to basically rest for a bit just to order. One or two days, one or two days. Missing ear? Broken nose. Deep abdomen cut. Pierced hand. Pierced shoulder. Ripped ear. <sighs> It's all going terribly. And seriously, dire wolves, I don't know if. It Are these plagued? We managed to get one of them. Gods above. We're putting this thing down now.
Come on. Just kill the blasted thing. He missed. What the hell are my guys paying you people for? Oh great, he's killed him. <sighs> he's in the bad health. He's missed. He's missed. How did you miss? How did you nearly hit that guy instead? And he's killed Twisted Tails as well. And that guy's rallied is coming back. How can you... Oh, you had everything, you'd have sealed these guys, have got nothing. Oh, I'm gonna lose this, I can just tell. I've got like, hardly any blokes left. Why is he not reloading? He's got arrows. Oh great, he's killed Kid Vermin. He's taken down Hawkin. Oh come on guys. I think this is where we end. Come on. Because Rogue's basically broken and fleeing. Can't do anything. <sighs> so, right, we've lost three of our people. Just great. I don't know how we're going to get over this. I mean, even pay wise, we're. Yeah, well, 250 gold is great. I mean, we've got no one left. Really, everyone's sort of sporting. He's traumatized. I mean, is there anybody in here we can ha hire? Oh, God, we just lost so many people. Some of these guys look okay, but we like we don't have any supplies to give them. Oh, gods, what do we do? Oh lord, this is gonna have to be for next episode, gents and ladies. We've lost so many people. I don't know what to do now. Um, 
most of our like veterans are wounded. Uh, it's not great. We're stuck out here and there's no real good jobs. I am considering my options desperately, but that will be have to be it for the moment. I've been Cornish Knight. If you have liked, please press the like button. If you wish to subscribe, please press the subscription button. Ah, oh God, I don't know. Whether that this has just been an absolute bloodbath. Um, I also catch you all next time on the next episode of Battle Brothers. Goodbye.